NPD police are investigating the city's latest shooting that brought the city to break an all time homicide record. And Fox 59's Bianca Reyes joins us. She's live in our newsroom with the latest case and how local officials are responding to this number. Good morning. Good morning. Many are calling this a tragic milestone. Yesterday's shooting marks the 180th homicide in Indianapolis, and there's still more than two months left in the year. Police tell us they were patrolling the area of 30th and Keystone just before 6.30 when an officer came across what he thought was a car accident. IMPD later found out the man inside the car had been shot to death. Police believe the car was stopped before the man was shot, and right now officers have not released any details on the damage to the car that would point towards a potential drive-by shooting. This 180th homicide now surpasses the city's all-time record of 179 set back in 2017. And you've heard me say it before. Learn how to resolve conflict resolution without picking up a handgun and firing someone. All of you have heard me say this before. You've heard it before. We're losing our young men and women at a rate throughout this country that is unacceptable. It is unacceptable. As of this morning, police do not have a suspect, but they're asking anyone near the 30th and Keystone area between 6 and 7 p.m. yesterday to call police at 262 TIPS. Now, coming up in the next hour, I'll bring you reaction from both our fraternal order of police and the city's mayor. For now, live in the newsroom, I'm Bianca Reyes, Fox 59 News.